hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl cc and we are back at it again today with another video and in today's video we are going to be reacting to a quick video um run back to allah and this is a powerful reminder um it's been a while since we did like a reminder type of video and today we are back with that so we are just going to get straight into it and if you are new here hello hi my name is cc and on my channel we do reaction videos to islamic content and yeah thank you for joining me today do not forget to stick around subscribe stay tuned for more videos comment your opinions in the comment section down below and with that being said guys let's get straight into today's video shall we لا يزال الخير حيا لا زال إن في الدنيا سلاما وظلال. You meet people who look at you and they insult religion, they insult you. This is not because they don't like you. This is not because they mean what they're saying. It's because in their heart they have gone to hardness and they have misled themselves and they don't even realize. Because Allah says in the Quran, if you forget me, I will cause you to forget yourself. You won't even realize why you're like that. And his solution is one. All he has to do, good news again, all he has to do, Allah says in the Quran, فَفِرُّ إِلَى اللَّهِ And the tafsir from Ibn Qayyim al-Jawzir, he says that what Allah says, فَفِرُّ إِلَى اللَّهِ It's from a distance. He's saying to you, run back. How can, it can't get more romantic and beautiful than that. I don't want you to go. Come back. And the moment you make tawbah and you're saying, Allah, forgive me, do you feel it, the burning? Do you feel the eyes welling up sometimes? You feel the heart when you're at home, you're gonna pray. You can feel the emotions coming. This isn't you. You can't decide, I want to repent. You cannot decide, I want to be forgiven. This is him. And he puts khushu in your heart and he pulls you. You just took instant and he guided the rest. You just instigated the slightest bit of your heart towards him. And he says, think of me, I'll think of you. Come to me, I'll come to you. Walk to me, I'll come to you at speed. Who else can remove the sins and forgive you except Allah? A believer is certain that I just repented and Allah has forgiven me. That is a fard, ayn. It is a must, it's obligatory that you believe that I made repentance and Allah has forgiven me. I'm an engineer, I'm an IT engineer, he's a doctor, he's this, she's that. Allah says, I am. I accept, I forgive sins and I accept repentance. He will definitely forgive you and he will definitely accept your repentance. Run back to me. You've walked far away when you commit sins, you go away from your Lord. Run back to that beginning, the fitrah. Polish your heart, remove the black spots and come back and I will forgive you. He says, I am in love with those who repent. So long as my slave continues to come back to me, so long as he realizes I am a forgiving Lord, all my angels bear witness, I will forgive him no matter what he does. Okay guys, so that brings me to the end of this beautiful reminder. And I feel like at times we just need to hear these things. You know that Allah will forgive us, you know, and I feel like a lot of us do not have that faith that he will forgive us um, depending on the type of sin that we do. We often sit and say, no, there's no way that Allah is going to forgive me for this hideous sin, you know, this unforgivable sin. But we also have to remember that you have to believe that Allah will forgive you. Otherwise, how is he supposed to forgive you if you don't even believe in his power? You know, and I do genuinely, genuinely feel like a lot of us do forget this fact that Allah is willing to forgive us. You know, he is willing to forgive us no matter how horrible the sin is. Have that faith that he is going to forgive you and he will and repent sincerely a lot of us also you know do not repent or do not ask for forgiveness in a sincere manner and oftentimes um that sin does still stick around so for me you know once i recognize that listen this is something i have done and it's not right I go and ask God for forgiveness. And of course, we are humans. You know, we are sinners. We are. 
and it's very hard to stay away from sin like it's very hard but i think the beauty comes in asking god for forgiveness you know bowing to him acknowledging that he is there and acknowledging that he will forgive you if you really and truly mean what you have said to him you know so yeah i genuinely feel like allah is there um he's willing to forgive us you know there is no sin that i feel like he may not forgive if you do not repent sincerely he is willing you just have to have that faith you know so yeah i hope this was a beautiful reminder to you guys and i'll see you guys in the next one please do not forget to like comment share and please do not forget to subscribe and take good care of yourselves bye guys